hello everyone welcome back to my channel so today i have a very exciting video for you guys today we are doing nails on a budget so pretty much we are going to be creating coffin shaped nails with baking soda isn't that awesome i purchased this baking soda at dollar tree it didn't cost me more than a dollar probably some cents and as you guys can see right here in this container i have already placed my baking soda and then next I am showing you guys an amazing file from the Dollar Tree as well that I will be using to file the nails right after. And you guys also have the option of choosing whatever colors you'd like to create this ombre matte coffin nails that I'm going to be showing you guys. And I got the I got all the polishes at the Dollar Tree except for the Essie one, which I actually got at Ulta for some for like a dollar in some sense. And then here I'm just showing you these little sponges that you can also get at the Dollar Tree they're only a dollar and that's how I will be creating the ombre look today right here I'm showing you guys a couple options that you guys can use as a base to create the baking soda nails and it's kind of like trial and error but these for the most part will work me on the other hand today I will be using the leafu by model ones base and top two in one to create the baking soda nails which it's just like the dip powder system so pretty much all you will need is a base of your choice and as you guys can see right here I am applying my base at the bottom of my nail to create a nice apex you could either do it at the center between the nail plate and the nail tip or you can start at the bottom just to form a nice apex so here I'm applying the base and dipping it right into the baking soda building up the nail to you know your liking By the way guys, do not forget that you only need a base, you do not need an activator because the baking soda just works so flawlessly with any base that you choose that obviously works with the baking soda. Like I said, it is trial and error, but by the way, I just want to let you guys know that you do not need an activator and just remember after each application, dust off your nails and then reapply it because I did ruin one of my brushes in the process because I did forget to dust them off. So here are how the nails turned out after I built them up to my liking. So as you guys can see, this is the finished result. Honestly guys, I definitely recommend you guys going out to get baking soda because it is just awesome. It's easier to work with an acrylic. It's easier to take off the nail. It doesn't damage the nail or anything. It's just a great alternative. So right here, I am grabbing my file that I also purchase at the Dollar Tree and pretty much since I want coffin nails I will just be going straight down the nail and then filing it at a 45 degree angle and buffing out the nail as well so here I'm just pretty much doing that
So here is the end result after shaping and buffing my nails. So as you guys can see, the, this is the results. I honestly am in love. I absolutely recommend this. I can't stress that enough. Yeah, so here we have the nails and now we're going to move on to grabbing the sponge. And here I'm pretty much just gonna apply the three colors of my choice, or you guys can do two colors, it's all up to you. So I'm just going to be applying all three colors and dabbing it on my nail. And you guys will see the process. So right here, I'm just grabbing 100% acetone with any brush. This is the one I had laying around. And I am going to now go around the cuticle area and clean up all the imperfections on the nail and perfect it. Okay guys, so here is the final result after cleaning around the nail and perfecting them. And as you guys can see, this is how they look. And by the way, all those imperfections that you see, they will be blurred out after you decide what top coat you choose. I am choosing a matte top coat, but you guys could also choose a shiny one. So here's another top coat that I recommend from the Dollar Tree that is awesome. And it's from LA Colors and it only costs a dollar and it honestly dries super quick. So that's another alternative if you want to stay on a budget. So here are the finished results after applying the matte top coat. As you guys can see, they look absolutely stunning. They look beautiful. I'm in love with the nails and it was really easy to do and it was so affordable. I don't think I spent more than $5 on this. 
and I definitely will be creating more and more content for you guys with baking soda because it is just phenomenal and it's affordable and I hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe till next time